Good morning, everybody. The floating head is back. How do we change? Oh, we're just going brighter. Meh. Hang on. Ah. There we go. Hello, guys. Good morning. Today is Friday the 12th. It's 10 to 11. I've been up since about half nine. I had a call that was just like vibrating and I, just, I missed it, but I was just like, why are you doing this to me anyway? Um, but yes, today it, I'm getting ready to film. I'm, pre I'm pretty. I don't like how dark this is here. <laughs> I've done all that. There we go, that's fine. I'm pretty much ready to film. I just need to change my top. Uh, my hair is this because I can't cope with my hair anymore. I, I don't know what to do right now. I need my weave like ASAP and I, I don't think I can cope with blonde anymore. Like my hair is so damaged already. Ooh, great fake tan. Yay. Like my hair is so damaged right now, but we're just going to give it a few more weeks and just see what happens. I want to basically put my weave in and keep that in for like three weeks. Um, and then I would have had like the blonde hair for a month and then go from there. Um, but it's just like the stage between like getting weave, it's just, it's, it's not cute basically. Like I can't do anything with this hair. I don't know what looks cute and what doesn't. Anyway, yeah, I'm about to film. My arm's aching already, wow, it's my life. Yeah, I'm about to film, then after I film my tutorial, I'm gonna film a haul, a Mac haul. Um, there's a lot of stuff, that's why it's, it's haul by itself. And then I'm gonna go to town and pick up a couple of things that I need to get. Um, and then, I think that's it. And then I'm going to make, make edit a video today. Um, and then I'm going to do some uni work and just chill out with Tam. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I've got my protein shake today. Oh, there we go. The banana flavour is just so much better than the vanilla flavour. Like, the vanilla flavour was, like, disgustingly sweet. And, like, you only you went to put in four scoops, and I put two in, and even then it was just so sweet. I tried milk, I tried water, I tried it in a, a smoothie, I tried it with pancakes, and I just could not have it. But then I brought the banana one, and I love the banana one. I can drink that one easily. My brows look... Ugh so good now that they're finally done um yeah i've got a few breakouts i've had that one on my chin for a while and the one like <clears throat> in the middle of my forehead that popped up a few days ago and then after the face mask i think the face mask kind of like brought it to its end <laughs> i don't know why it sounds sad about a spot being popped um but yeah so when i film now i'm thinking if i should do like a voiceover or a talk through because i have my window open because it's really warm again and I don't want like the sounds to be like distracting if like there's ambulances or anything, but I feel like I wanna talk to you guys. I might just do a talk through and just say fuck it. But yeah, so I'm gonna go and film now and I will see you guys on the other side. Hey guys, so I've just finished filming. This is what it looks like. Ooh, very bright in this camera, aren't we? Why do we always go through this debacle? There, that's what it looks like. Blah, blah, blah very bright um for mid-february but you know not very bright very like summery for mid-february i just wanted to show you guys this is a normal beauty like a dry beauty blender and this is a damp one so that's like this oh yeah so that's like the size difference just in case you guys were curious um so i'm just tidying up my stuff I used because I am filming the haul but my concierge has the parcel at the moment and she's a bit you have to be there at like a certain time to collect it only like so I've got like half an hour left until I can collect it um so I thought I would just get started on tidying up my makeup really because then I'm gonna film on the bed um, my first video on there basically. I don't know how I feel about this makeup, you know. I don't know. It looks a bit like muddyish. 
I'll have to look at the footage because I may have to refilm. Hopefully not because that's the worst thing is when you film something and you have to refilm it. I absolutely hate that so much. Um, but yeah. <sighs> I'm just... I don't know what I am. I'm complaining basically. As per usual. I can hear Tom coming. I can still hear Tom coming. Are we going in the other room? Oh. Fancy, fancy. I feel like me and this brightness, there we go. I have just beef all the time. And I don't know why he wants to mess with my life. Um, but yeah, it's so basically there. Yeah, I'm just tidying now. And then once I fill my mat call, I'm going to go to town. <gasps> my camera nearly fell. I'm so clumsy with this camera. It's actually a joke, like, wow. And we're in the, uh, not Isla, the Ardell Demi Wispies. What is the hype? I don't know. I don't get it myself. I don't understand. I don't get it. Um, but yeah, so I will see you guys probably after I film Mac haul. Um, yeah. One haul video and parcel later. <laughs> hey guys, so I've just filmed my haul. Oh, it looks nice like this. Yeah, I just filmed my MAC haul and I got my Mal Cosmetics order in the post and I was just playing with it and look at that pigment and look at that pigmentation for the eyeshadow. It's crazy, like, wow. I was meant to get another order today as well, um, but the delivery guy has lost my parcel. But the delivery guy has like lost my parcel, which I'm like fuming about, but I don't know what's going on. They said that they're going to call me, so I'm just waiting for them to call me. Um, but yeah, I'm happy I got my Mount Cosmetics order now because I, I ordered it ages ago. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it now. So I'm going to make myself some lunch because I'm quite hungry. I haven't eaten today. I've only had my protein shake, which apparently is, is meant to make, make you not hungry, but it makes me hungry. So yeah. Oh, I'm just so tired now. I want to take a nap, but I need to go to town still. Do I really want to go to town? No, actually, I don't. But I know I will because I need to. Anyway, yeah, I'm going to make myself some food and I'll show you what I eat because I don't know if it's going to be fun or not. But either way, I'll show you. So I just tried avocado for the first time. Not a fan. You no. actually know I didn't. I liked the buttery bagel I had alongside it. Basically, like, I can't eat tomatoes because I'm allergic to them and a lot of people eat it with tomato and salt and pepper, so I ate it with, what? With salt and pepper and it just like, the only thing that tasted nice, nice was the salt, I mean the pepper. So, I'm gonna have to pause this for copyright issues, sorry. Oh, Tom's making a smoothie as well. Lime, carrots, ginger, water. Oh, very watery. I want to be a drink at Oh, okay. Use your other hand as well. Hmm? Use your other hand as well. Here's a balance. Ba what are you balancing? <laughs> Taste some. Let me smell it. <laughs> it just smells like shredded carrots. Open your mouth. What? She's got something in your teeth. That's all. Chill out. You're not going to taste it? I'm gonna have to in a glass sentence again. My name's Tom and I love shelf. I want you to taste it. I can't do that. I look. I don't know, freak. Just get that out. We need to chop the mangoes as well and the pineapple. Can I have a smoothie to my his reaction to his drink. <laughs>
do you think? It's all right. I think they've got a bit too much lime in there, though. He keeps having problems with his limes. It's all right, though. Is it all right? Yeah, yeah. In one still. Okay. And I'm going to have a flake yogurt to counteract for that horrible avocado situation. If anyone eats avocado but doesn't have tomato, can you let me know what you have with it, please? Because I tried it with a bagel because I love sesame seed bagels, but it still couldn't work for me. I could not eat that. Oh. But yeah, I'm going to go and get ready and then I'm going to go to town. Time you coming to town with me, yeah? No. <laughs> hey, guys. So, wow, my hair. This is my life. This is it's my life. So, it is... 10 past 4. I've just come back from town. I went to get the rest of Tom's Valentine's presents, which I will show you on Valentine's Day, just in case he somehow watches this. Um, and yeah, I've brought a couple of things as well. I brought this jumper, which is like the black version to the white one I had from H&M, um, which is just like this. And I love it because I love the white one so much, but sometimes I struggle to wear it like right now because... Um, it's a bit like, it's a bit like springy, summery, whereas the black one could pass a bit more as winter. I don't know, maybe it's in my head. I still wear the white one anyway. And then I brought another black jumper. I think this is like the fourth or the fifth one I have of the same exact jumper, but I love this jumper so much. I've always had a problem because I'm a chunky girl. Uh, I got a big belly full of food and I got big boobies. When I wear jumpers, usually it looks hilarious they never look flattering and they just it it's just a no and ever since i found that jumper and it's looked nice on me i've been like no i found my my jumper i'm gonna just buy shitloads of it so that's why i have done with it because i've been so happy that i can finally wear jumpers and then i also bought myself a dvd i bought myself mean girls because i just want a girly day with myself because i don't have any friends who want to watch it with me or want to spend time with me if any of you guys want to be friends in real life i'm so down for that because i need some and girlfriends like she's cray and I went to Superdrug just to get a couple of things um, and I just show you I basically went to get hair dye for my weave um, because it's not lifting nicely so I went to get hair dye for it to do it it was like two three eleven pounds so I got light blonde and golden light blonde I got some Veet hair removal Valentine's Day is approaching I got two nail varnishes. I got a white one because I want to paint my toenails this colour and I don't know if I have a white nail varnish or not. And then I have, oh, this is Burble from Barium. Then I have the Manny Mask and it's a camouflage, colour and condition. And it's treatment for nails, strengthens and conditions damaged nails, conceals with a semi-matte colour finish. Um, I never really have my natural nails anyway, so I'm not going to use it for that. I just really liked the colour. It's quite like a nudie. Oh yeah, the fake tan situation is, there we go. No comments. Uh, it's just like a nudie pink really, which is really pretty. I picked up some more of my cotton pads for my cleanser and toner because I've run out. Oh yes, I picked up an eyeliner from The Balm and it's just called, whoa, Brian B Beige. It's just a nude liner basically because um, apparently this one's meant to be really, really good. So I thought I'd... Give it a go and there it is. These two of my swatches earlier from my MAC haul and they just won't come off. I love Pro Longwear lip liners. They're just a fucking business. I picked up a brush from Makeup Revolution. This is the Ultra Metals Ultra Flat Contour Brush because you guys will have already seen it so I can talk about it. Thank you for that. I did a drugstore haul um, in which I got this which is a Freedom Contour Brush because it came in with a palette. Um, and I want to try out other drugstore brushes and Makeup Revolution is drugstore. Like, I don't really know if I would pass Real Techniques as being one or not, but oh well. Anyway, so it just looks like that. It's a bit more chunkier than what I'm used to, um, but we'll see. And what I said in the tutorial for this look today was that I want to find a new cream contour brush. So I'm going to try some of those out. And then the last two things that I got were a pair of Isla lengthening 155 lashes which you guys know I love and then I got the pair 143 which just looked like that um and that's that's all I picked up really guys I know that people are like is that all you picked up so much I can't remember if I showed you my Mount Cosmetics so it finally came if I'm honest I can't remember what I've spoken to you guys about today or not but either way so I picked up this grey lipstick which is so 
buff and pigmented i saw a look on instagram and it was a gray lip and it had like a yellowy citrusy color around it and i can't i don't know who did it i've googled it and everything and it's not coming up and i really want to recreate it but i want to give props to the person who did it if anyone has seen this picture or knows who did it please let me know because i want to give props and i want to do a tutorial with that i want to do like a i i know what i know i'm doing already don't worry don't worry i know i know um and then i finally got the radioactive stack so i got this the day it came out and i've only just received it in the post today so i'm pissed about that but it's cool i now have all the melt stacks and i think they're amazing so there's this shade here which is like a vibrant ready pinky color a yellow uh, a greeny lime color and then oh, could you not just dye this this is called radioactive and it's like this matte like beautiful pink shade and then um, this is meant to be a pressed pigment and then that one's an eyeshadow that one's an eyeshadow and then that one's a pressed pigment um but guys it's so stunning if you guys like color go and get them if you guys don't like color look at the other ones where are the other stacks that i have i'll show you so I've just like combined mine together. So I have like the Dark Matter and the uh, Love Sick stack. And they're just they're so pigmented and they're so big compared to usual eyeshadows like Love. Those are all my melt eyeshadows. That's hilarious. I love it. But yeah, so that's pretty much all that's happened today. I can't remember if I've told you guys that my parcel went missing and I saw the guy when I went out to town. I saw him and I was like, have you found it yet? And he was like, oh, no, 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 it's going to come tomorrow. And I'm like, but if you haven't found it, then how do you know it's coming tomorrow? Like, you know, those times that you just got to breathe in, breathe in. Um, but yeah. Oh. The decluttering I need to do today. I actually was doing my MAC haul and I found out that I had I brought a shade that I already have. So that's going to go. What is this brush? Oh, so that's going to go in the declutter. I'm going to just quickly tidy up this room a little bit. It won't take long. Just like put away things. And then I will do the declutter. And I'll probably show you guys it as well. And then this spot, it's just like, oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> Um, I'll probably show you guys it and then I will also like just do the declutter too um, And also on my last vlog which was yesterday I got a couple of comments of people asking if they can have things that I said I was gonna put on Depop Do you, I don't know if you guys watch time um, Turn the infamous she does like an annual or semi-annual I don't know um, Cyber sale where she puts things on YouTube to sell do you guys want me to do that as well? And just like because I know not everyone has Depop but if you want, I can do that and make it international. But you guys would have to pay for that. Like, it's not going to be like a declutter or a giveaway. It's going to be like a sale. If you guys are interested in that, then let me know. And I'll put some of the stuff on here as well. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it, really, guys. I will speak to you guys soon. Don't know when. Just depends. Hey, guys. So, you're so... Oh dark. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, that's just what I was just Oh my god. One sec. Hey guys, sorry about that. Um I made some parcel turned up and I just want to open it. I'm halfway through decluttering. Most of it is foundations. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven foundations. Three pairs of lashes and a bronzer so far. But I'm also like, sorting my collection out as well. Oh, oh my gosh, that was, oh, that was hard. Um, do I show you what's in here or do I add it to my haul? Um, I don't think there's that much in here. Because I'm doing a Sephora haul and I'm adding the stuff that I got from Cult Beauty to it. Oh. So I don't know if I should add oh, this stuff as well or not. No, I'll just show you on here. It's quite pathetic actually. First off, I got the EX1 Delete Concealer in the shade D100, which is the lightest one they do. It looks like that. I don't know why I'm like that. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm excited, excited. 
Don't put that with the giveaway, Sophie. I got the EX1 blush in the shade Pretty in Pink. It just looks like that. Again, I'm like this. I don't know what's wrong with me. And then I got the Shishido Perfecting Stick Concealer in the shade 11 Light. Because I'm running low on mine. So I just bought me back up. I should keep this in the packaging so I know not to use both of them at the same time. Oof. Then I got a brush from Sigma. This is my first ever Sigma brush. Look fantastic. Do Sigma brushes, which is amazing. Um, it's my first ever Sigma brush, so I'm so excited. And I didn't get loads because I only wanted to really try this one because the others are quite dupable. But this is like the 3D one. Um, and I'm just really excited to use it, really. So I picked him up. And then... The reason why I made the order was for this. So this is the uh, Philip Kingsley Elasticate Elasticizer Elasticizer? I don't know. Um, thing. And oh my bloody lord. Jesus. It looks like a water bottle. And that's what it looks like. This is a hair mask. Um, it costs a lot of money, it costs £85, but for this size, I got the biggest one. You can get smaller ones. And this is intensive super conditioning pre shampoo treatment for all hair types. Adds elastic, 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 no, elasticity, elastic, elastic. Tea, last tea. I don't know. Uh, manageability, bounce and shine direction, blah blah, ingredients, blah blah. Super for use on coloured hair, coloured treated hair. So I'm really excited to use this because you guys know that my hair has been in pretty pretty bad condition. So I'm excited to try this out. I am, however. Ah right. I want to know what you smell like. You're not going to open, are you? I want to know what you smell like. I can't smell anything, but I don't want it to pour out onto anything. Ugh. Ugh, shush, please, children. Oh, there we go. It doesn't smell like anything. Um, but yes, like like I said, I'm super excited to try this out. I will keep you updated with how it goes. Um, and yeah, so I'm gonna try that probably tonight, if I'm being honest. Um, and yeah, I'm just currently in the middle of sorting out my giveaway thing. Um, not giveaway, decluttering. Um, and yeah, I say um a lot because I, I'm always lost for words. <laughs> I never know what I'm actually talking about half the time. But yeah, I'm gonna get back to this and I will tune in with you guys in a sec. I think after this, me and Tom are gonna watch some stuff on TV. I wanna watch Hollyoaks. I, want, I might actually do this face mask, this hair mask straight away and like leave it in for like a few hours and just put cling film over my head because it is pretty bad. And so many of you guys are um, happy about my brows for me. I'm so happy, you don't understand like, I knew I know I grew them quite thick, but I did that so that when I shaped them like this, they would be thick enough to be a shape. Like I would go out the house with them like this. Whereas before, I was watching one of my old vlogs because someone commented on like a really old vlog, and I was like, oh my god, my brows were like it is. I had like hair here, and then it was like the thinnest line ever, and I was like, why did why did you grow them like that? But I've had some pretty damn embarrassing brows, so. Anything is a step up from what I used to have. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm gonna go in and just finish off with this. I love how the fairy lights mean I don't need a lamp. I mean, a lamp on, but I might put a lamp on anyway. Yeah, baby. Um, where is the wire? Four. Center? I don't know, in there. Yeah. Um, oh, try the, you know, the black box in the storeroom. You know, the one that's got like the mini hoover and that in. I've put all the, the stuff that was around there in there. Tom's fixing up the printer, bless him. Well, he's making the printer. I've had a printer for like two years and I've never used it. It doesn't even have like anything to it, so yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna go and finish off this and I'll see you guys in a sec.
Okay guys, so the decluttering is done. I can't say goodbye to any more makeup. Right, let's do this thing then. It is chick to rock around to rock around us and I'm that is Right. So, we still have stuff left over from last time. Right, we have our samples which were all from Dior, blah 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 blah. We have the Body Shop Eye Cream. Inglot sample. Again, Inglot sample. We have Benefits Rocketeer sample blush. The Beauty Bay lip gloss. Benefits lip gloss. The Freedom Spot Cream. If you have claimed any of these in the last decluttering and you're thinking, why is she doing it again? You need to message me your address, basically. That's why. So you need to mes message me your address. Um, the Barry and Brow Pencil. The eyelashes, which have like purple bits in them. The two Saint Pay things. The Bare Minerals Prime Time Primer. Um, uh, I think, oh no, the Charlotte Tilbury Magic Cream Tree and Transform Moisturizer. And that's it from the last one. So like I said, if you have like, ooh, one sec. Like I said, if I, like I said, if you have said you wanted that and you um, are thinking what the hell's going on, you need to message me your address, please. Right, next thing, the NYX BB Cream Beauty Balm uh, thing. This is in the shade, do you have a shade? Yes, golden number three. This has been used maybe once or twice. It is a bit dirty here. I will wipe that before I send it to you. The next thing is this Fashion Fair foundation. This is in the shade Honey. This has been not used at all. It's just been swatched. It looks a lot. It's actually a lot darker than this. Hold on, my computer's like. It is quite dark. Let me turn the lamp on. There we go. That's what it looks like. If you're buying foundation, I mean, if you're getting foundations from me, then please look at the shades because I'm not accepting returns or shit. Sorry. Pair of lashes in the style 47, they're just like full. And then two lashes, which are the same ones, and these are Red Cherry 747 Owls. And they just look like that. So there's two of them for grabs. The MAC Freshen Up Highlight Powder from a collection. I can't remember what collection it is. A NYX Illuminator, which looks like this, and this is in the shade Magentic. It's like pinky champagne-y. A New Look Pure Colour Bronzing Powder in the shade Warm Tan. I think that's been used to swatch and that's it. Um, a Makeup Revolution Vivid Baked Bronzer, which I think I've only swatched. This is in the shade Ready To Go. The Revlon thingy, which has only been used once in a tutorial, but I didn't really like it. Um, I have this and I don't know if I'm going to get rid of it or not because it's cracked. Um, and I'm scared that it will just completely demolish. So I probably, I don't know yet. We'll think about him for the rest of the night and I'll let you know. A NARS Super Orgasm. Okay, he doesn't want to go. <laughs> no, super orgasm illuminate. I think I've used this once. Um, you just get a lot of gap like in all of them. A MAC face and body foundations shade C4. This has been used quite a lot. I would say there's quite a bit left in it. Uh, maybe like there or something, but if you just want to try it out. So just be aware, like, you know, I have used that quite a lot. So please be aware. Uh, the Chanel Perfection Lumiere. Uh, in the shade 50 beige the fashion fair true finish refining mineral foundation in the shade sexy sand stable sexy i don't know it just says both names so yeah for that uh the becca ultimate coverage complex cream in the shade olive i don't know if i'm going to give this away because it's quite dirty but if anyone wants it then you can have it uh, it's in the it's the Garnier BB Cream Miracle Skin Perfector in the shade Medium. I've used it like once or twice, but it's just got quite dirty. But if you want it, I will wipe it down for you. Um, I'll leave it in here just in case anyone does want it. But if you don't, it's no biggie. 
And then finally is a brand new MAC eyeshadow in the shade Amber Lights. So that's everything I'm getting rid of. Same rules apply. But I'm going to say, um, should I say one item per person or two? Because it's not going to be worth it if I do one item for postage. Um, God, that's what happens when my computer screen goes in full blast. Um, yeah, so two items per person. Um, 24 hours. You have to message me your address. I'm not following up for people. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Guys. So oh, that's all done. The reason why I haven't sent off the other stuff is because I wanted to get rid of everything at once rather than keeping making trips to the post office in case people who got stuff in the last one get stuff in this one. There's no point in me sending out like three parcels to you or whatever. Um but yeah, I'm done now. I've organised my makeup and everything. This is too bright for me, sorry. Um Yeah, I'm done now, and it's 20 past 6, so I'm just going to put this hair mask on and then just un what? And just unwind with the time, basically, so I will catch up with you guys, probably when I look like a weirdo with my hair, like I do now. Um, yeah, probably catch up with you guys when I've got like, a weird hair mask on, so wish me luck. Oh my god, my camera's like picking up the penguin's face, it keeps like flashing to focus on it. I don't think I can process what I just watched right now. I just watched Charlie. By the way, I got my hair mask on. I just watched Charlie Hooks. I think <sighs> the last minute was the best piece of Charlie Hooks I've seen for a few months. Like, shit. Tom, what's your thoughts? Why? I didn't expect that. So. I am right now just very confused about everything in life. I'm questioning everything that's happening in my life. I'm, I, I, what? Oh my God, now the 100 advert? No, it's not the 100, thank God. The 100 starts back, is it next Wednesday? Or something, I can't remember, but. Oh my God, and then the House of Cards starts on in March. I just. No, it's like that because it all comes at one, out at once, isn't it? No, that's not good. Put the heating back on, I'm getting cold. I am just. Woo! Woo! Mm-mm, 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 mm-mm. Hey guys, so I've just like, sort of blow dry my hair. Guys, oh. One sec, I need to turn this brightness up because you guys need to see. It has made my hair so soft. Like I had really bad like breakage on it because I was so bleached in, went blonde and you know, you guys know what happened. And it was so bad, it was so tough and it was like so strawy, like really bad. It's made my hair so soft. Admittedly, I had the face, the hair mask in for about three hours. Um, it says like 10 to 20 minutes, but I thought because it's my first time and how damaged it was, I'd do a lot of time. So I did three hours. Guys, it's so soft. Oh, I recommend it completely. Even if you try the smaller size, like if you have damaged hair, get it. It's amazing. So, oh, it's so soft. I think I'm going to start to light my blonde now. Hey guys, so this battery has been dead all day. I don't know how it's lasted. Um, yeah, hi guys. I... I'm just in bed now. I'm just chilling on the websites, you know, how you do. Been replying to some comments as they've been coming in. And yeah, so I'm going to call it a night now because we're up early tomorrow. Wow, not early, but you know, earlier than I used, usually do. Used to do? Usually do. We get up about half eight ish, so we can go to the gym in the morning and then come home and. Get ready to film. I'm really excited to film tomorrow. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to call it a night here now. I don't know how much footage I've got today. Hopefully enough that you guys aren't mad at me. I don't know. But yeah, so I will speak to you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow all I'm doing is filming. I might pop back to town because I've forgotten one of Tom's presents. Well, I haven't forgotten. I didn't know I wanted to get it in until today. I'm whispering because he's in the next room. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it guys. So I will speak to you guys tomorrow have a good night or day or whatever oh as for the um decluttering makeup that i did today um as always it's just first come first so kind of situation um and it is international so have fun okay good night bye